Welcome, my friend. This is day 31, the final day of the 31 days of yin and yang. You can get this free yoga training plan and start at any time, though. To learn more and get your free copy, pop down to the description of this video. We close our 31 days with this sweet, full body releasing evening flow. We will flow through sun salutations. Each variation will include a creative twist to help you further release the tension from your body, clear your mind so you step off the mat feeling relaxed and calm in body, mind, and spirit. With all of that said, I'll join you standing at the front of the mat. Let's bring your right palm to your heart center, left on top of your right. Go ahead and close those eyes. Stand up nice and tall, second your head over your heart and your heart over your pelvis. Feel into your body. Notice the energy of you. Feel that heartbeat. Notice the rhythm of your breath, the temperature of your body. We'll move into Sun Salutation A. Let's breathe in, circle your fingertips up to the sky. Palms kiss, reach back into a back bend before you dive it down through center. Forward fold. We'll breathe in, lift halfway, nice flat back. And then from here, we're gonna hop or step back into plank pose. Exhale, lower halfway, chaturanga. Big, beautiful breath in, upward facing dog. Using the muscles of your pelvic floor, lift your hips to down dog. Step or hop to the front of the mat. Breathe in, lift halfway. Exhale, melt chest to thighs. Big, beautiful breath in, circling fingertips up. Palms kiss and lower prayer to heart. We'll take two more rounds just like that. Breathe in, circle your fingertips right back up. Palms kiss, reach back into that back bend, lifting your heart. Exhale, dive it down through center. Breathe in, lift halfway. On the exhale, hop or step back from plank pose. Exhale, lower halfway, chaturanga. Big, beautiful breath in, upward facing dog. Press and lift your hips up to down dog. Let's hop or step to the front of the mat. Forward fold. Breathe and lift halfway. Nice long spine. Exhale, melt chest to thighs. Big breath in, circling those fingertips down, around and up. Your palms kiss the top. And lower prayer to heart center. Last one. Breathe in, circle your fingertips up. Palms kiss, reach back. Dive it down through center. Forward fold, melt chest to thighs, breathe and lift halfway, flat back, crown of head reaches forward. We'll hop or step back to plank pose. Exhale, lower halfway, chaturanga, inhalation, upward facing dog. And press and lift those hips to down dog. Hop or step to the front of the mat. Breathe and lift halfway. Exhale, melt forward. Let's take a big nourishing breath in as you circle your fingertips up to the sky, gathering love and light. Palms kiss. Bring all that love and light down to heart center. Bring your right palm to your heart center, left on top of your right. Let's take a moment to feel into you. Connecting with your energy. Connecting with yourself, your body, 
your mind, your spirit here on the mat. Feel into you. Moving on to Sun Salutation C. All right, let's go ahead and begin. Breathe and circle your fingertips up to the sky. Palms kiss, reach back. Feel that juicy back bend before you dive it down through center. Forward fold. Breathe and lift halfway. Exhale, melts forward, and then we'll step your right foot back. Fingertips to the mat, lift your heart, runner's lunge, just for one breath. And then step your front foot back for plank pose. Exhale, lower halfway, chaturanga. Big, beautiful breath in, upward facing dog. And press and lift your hips up to down dog. Let's step your right foot forward. Hands from your foot, fingertips to the mat. Lift your heart. Hips are square, sinking into the pose. Let's bend into your back. Need to step your back foot to the front for a forward fold. Breathe and lift halfway. Exhale, melt forward. Big, beautiful breath in, circling your fingertips up. Palms kiss. And lower prayer to heart center. Two more with a creative twist. Release your hands to your side. Ground down through your left sole foot, coming into tree pose. You can bring your right foot to your ankle, your calf, or above your knee joint. Wherever you find yourself, it's right where you should be. Bring palms, prayer at heart center. Press your foot into your thigh and your thigh presses back, palms fused together. Everything is hugging into the midline. Press your right knee open. Option to extend your fingertips up to the sky. Good, now from here, bring your right knee, hug it in towards your chest. Then on your exhale, we're gonna move into warrior three pose. So leaning your torso forward as you extend your back leg back. Warrior three. With control, lower your back foot to the mat. Lower hands to frame your front foot. Runner's lunge. Step your front foot back. Plank pose. Exhale, lower halfway chaturanga. Big, beautiful breath in, upward facing dog. And then lift those hips to down dog. Step your right foot forward on the inhale. Hips square, lift your heart. Bend into your back knee to step your back foot forward and forward fold. Inhalation, lift halfway. Exhale, melt forward. Big breath in, circling fingertips down, around and up. Palms kiss and lower prayer to heart. Last one of Sun Salutation Z. Tree pose on the second side, so ground down through your right sole foot. When you're ready, bring your left foot to your ankle, to your calf, or above your knee joint. We just don't want to be on that knee joint. Bring hands, prayer to heart center, pressing that foot into your thigh. Thigh presses back, palms fused together. Find your gisti. Energetically press your left knee away. Option to extend your fingertips up to the sky. Good work, my friend. From here, go ahead and hug your knee up in towards your chest, lift it up, up, up. And then we're moving into our warrior three. So begin to lean your torso forward as you extend your back leg back. Warrior three. With control, lower your back foot to the mat. Hands lower to frame your front foot. Front foot back for plank pose. Exhale, chaturanga. Inhalation, upward facing dog. Press and lift those hips to down dog. Nice fluid movement. Let's step that left foot forward. Lift that heart, hips square. 
foot forward, forward fold. Inhalation, lift halfway. Exhale, melt chest to thighs. Big, beautiful breath in. Circling your fingertips up to the sky, gathering love and light. Palms kiss. And bring all that love and light down to your heart center. Right palm to your heart, left palm on top. Close your eyes. Feel into yourself. Feel into your energy. Feel into what you're cultivating here on the mat. What intention are you setting? Soft smile upon your face. Inviting that positive, loving energy in. We'll move into sun salutations. We are next. Go ahead and release your hands at your side. We're going to move into chair pose. So feet can be hip distance or you can bring your feet into kiss. On your in breath, sit your hips back in space as you reach your fingertips to the sky for chair pose. Let's breathe in. Exhale. Seeing the hips a little lower. Breathe in. And exhale, dive forward, forward, fold. Breathe and lift halfway. We'll hop or step back into plank pose. Exhale, lower chaturanga. Inhalation, upward facing dog. Let's press and lift those hips up to down dog. Step your right foot forward near your right thumb. Lower your back heel to the mat at a 45 degree angle. Then on your inhale, sweep your fingertips up to the sky. Warrior one, bring your palms to kiss. Take your gaze up towards your fingertips. Beautiful. Lower hands to frame your front foot. Back heel pops up, step back for plank pose. Exhale, lower halfway, chaturanga. Inhalation, upward facing dog. Now let's lift those hips to down dog. Step your left foot forward this time. Lower your back heel to the mat, keeping that 45 degree angle. Feet are on two separate tracks. On the inhale, sweep your fingertips up to the sky. Warrior one. Bring palms to kiss at the top. Take your gaze up towards your fingertips. Good work, my friend. Lower hands to frame your front foot. Back heel pops up, step your front foot back, plank pose. Exhalation, lower halfway, chaturanga. Inhalation, upward facing dog. And lift those hips to down dog. Step one foot forward and then the other, forward fold. Breathe and lift halfway. You can keep your feet at hip distance or bring your heels in to kiss. And on your inhale, lower your seat back in space as you sweep your fingertips up for chair pose. Breathe in. Exhale, sink the hips. This time on your inhale, press down through your soles of feet to lift up. Fingertips reach back, lift your heart. Bring your palms to kiss. Exhale, lower prayer to heart center. Breathe in, exhale out your mouth. Breathe in, exhale a sigh out your mouth, releasing and letting go. Once more, breathe in, exhale out your mouth, releasing, letting go of any excess energy. it over. Moving into sun salutation B, our second round. Sink your hips back in space. Have you lift your fingertips up to the sky? Chair pose. 
Breathe in, feeling your rib cage expand front to back and side to side, and exhale. Bring hands prayer to heart center, moving into a twist. Let's breathe in. And on your exhale, twist and open to the left side. So your left tricep will come to the outside of your right thigh. Palms press and fuse together. Take your gaze towards the sky. And then when you're ready with control, shift your weight into your right sole foot to step your left foot back. Good work, my friend. One more breath in the twist. On your next exhale, lower hands to frame your front foot. Lower your back heel to the mat, coming into that warrior one. So on the in-breath, sweep your fingertips up to the sky. Let's bring your palms to kiss at the top and lift your gaze towards the fingertips if that's within your practice. On your next exhale, lower hands to frame your front foot. We'll step your front foot back for plank pose. Exhale, chaturanga. Upward facing dog. And lift your hips to down dog. Step your left foot near your left thumb. Back heel lowers to the mat at that 45 degree angle. On your inhale, we'll sweep your fingertips up to the sky, your hip points square to the front of the mat. Palms kiss, lift your gaze. Beautiful, my friend. On your exhale, lower hands to frame your front foot. Back heel pops up and step your front foot back. Plank pose. Take your flow, chaturanga, to upward facing dog. And down dog. Step or hop to the front of the mat, coming into forward fold. Let's breathe and lift halfway. Exhale, melt forward. Feet hip distance or into kiss. On your next inhale, sweep your fingertips up as you lower your hips back in space. So you're sitting into a chair for chair pose. Breathe in. Exhale, sink those hips a little lower. On your next inhale, press down to your soles of feet to lift and rise up. Reach back, back bend, lift that heart. Palms kiss and lower prayer to heart. Breathe in through your nose. Open your mouth, exhale, sigh out your mouth. Breathe in. Exhale out, release and let go. Let any tension melt away. Breathe in. Exhale out the mouth. Our final sun salute be. This time we'll do minimal cues. Just let this be nice, fluid movement. Your breath flows with the movement. On your next inhale, reach your fingertips up and sit your sits bone back in space on the exhale. Bring your hands prayer to heart center while holding chair pose. Let's breathe and lengthen up through your crown ahead. And on your exhale, we're going to twist to the left. Bring your tricep to the outside of your left leg. Stack your shoulders. Shift your weight into your left sole foot. And with control, we'll step your right foot back. Press and fuse your palms together to find space across your chest, your collarbone. On your exhale, lower hands to frame your front foot. Back heel lowers to the mat. Inhalation, sweep your fingertips up to the sky. Palms kiss, look up. On the exhale, lower hands to frame your front foot. Step your front foot back, plank pose. Chaturanga, upward facing dog. Lift those beautiful hips to down dog. Flowing with your breath. Step your right foot forward. Back heel lowers to the mat. On your in breath, sweep your fingertips up to the sky for your warrior one. 
Bring palms to kiss, lift your gaze. Hands lower to frame your foot. Step your front foot back, plank pose. Chaturanga, upward facing dog, and lift those hips to down dog. Hop or step to the front of the mat, forward fold. Breathe in, lift halfway. Exhale, melt forward. Begin to bend into your knees as you lower your seat back in space. Sweep fingertips to the sky, chair pose. On your inhale, press down to your soles of feet to lift up. Reach your fingertips back, lifting that heart. Shoulder heads draw back. Shoulder blades squeeze in towards one another. Palms kiss and lower prayer to heart. Bring your right palm to your heart center. Left on top of the right, caressing your heart. Feel that heartbeat. Your heart pumping blood to all the organs in your body, nourishing you. Breathing in, nourishing oxygen through your nose. Notice the temperature of your body. Notice your energy. How is your energy now compared to when you first stepped on the mat? Release palms down to your side. Mountain pose. Breathe in, circle your fingertips up. Palms kiss, reach them back. One last back bend. Dive it down through center, forward fold. Let's just hang out here in forward fold for five breaths. Releasing that upper body, letting it weigh heavy. On your exhales, visualize that any, any negative thoughts, energy, it's pouring out of your head with your exhale and you're giving it over to Mother Earth. Release fingertips to the mat. Step one foot back and then the other, finding your downward facing dog. This is your final downward facing dog. So just take whatever moves are intuitively calling to you. Close your eyes and just listen to your body. Breathing as you hold. Feeling that heartbeat slow down with each breath you take. Find stillness at summer. Lower your knees to the mat. Bring your big toes to kiss, your knees open as wide as the mat, and sink those hips back to your heels for child's pose. Go ahead and take a slow rock, a slow sway of your hips side to side, releasing those hips, massaging the hip joint, releasing. Still finding that nice fluid movement, sinking your breath as you flow. Finding comfort in your breath. We'll slowly roll up. Sit off to the side of your feet to bring them out in front of you. Bring your soles of feet to the mat. Roll your shoulder heads up and back, finding your nice long spine. Let's do a little core movement before we make our way to the mat. It's a boat pose. Lift one chin parallel with the earth and then the other. As you hold boat pose, reach up through the crown of your head, roll the shoulder heads up and back. Nice flat back. 
with each exhale. Lower belly firms up and in, drawing that navel back to your spine. Exhale those powerful breaths out your nose, like Ujjayi Pranayama. Try to get your inhales and your exhales to be of equal length. Just turn that attention inward. Stay present in your body as you hold this. Feel your body if it's trembling. That's good stuff if it is. That's your strength, that's your energy, that's your chi. Take a big breath in, and on your exhale, lower yourself back to the mat, hug your knees in towards your chest. Lower your soles of feet to the mat, feet hip distance, moving into bridge pose next. So arms at your side, palms face down. Let's breathe in. And on your in-breath, we're going to press down through your soles of feet to slowly ripple through your spine, beginning at your tailbone as you press your hips up towards the sky. Once you're at the top, hold it there. You can interlace your fingers behind your low back, shimmering those shoulders underneath you. Press down through your soles of feet to lift those hips up. Imagine that you're holding a yoga block between your legs to help prevent your knees from splaying open. Lengthen your tailbone towards your knees. Hold it. Continue to breathe. To release, bring your palms at your side. Let's breathe in, and on your exhale, beginning from top to bottom, slowly lower yourself to the mat. Good. We're moving into plow pose next. So if you have a bun in your hair or ponytail back there, you might want to release it so you don't crunch your neck. Once again, arms down at your side, palms face down. On your inhalation, use your abdominal muscles to lift your legs and hips up towards the sky. Bring your torso perpendicular to the floor, then straighten your legs and slowly lower your toes to the earth. Legs fully extended. Now if your toes don't touch, you can support your back with your hands. Lower your legs as far as possible. If your feet rest comfortably, go ahead and extend your arms along the mat. Keep space between your chin and your chest, while at the same time lift your chest to open the upper back. Soften through your throat. Breathe and enjoy this final opening, allowing your mind to quiet. To release, support your back with your hands, then slowly roll down with the intent of going down one vertebra at a time, bending your knees if you need to. And then one at a time, extend your legs out long, moving into our final pose, Shavasana. Arms at your side, palms face up. Arms taking up as much space as you'd like. Smooth, steady breaths in, smooth, steady breaths out. We'll take 10 breaths here. No need to count though. Just let yourself be here with your breath in your body in this moment here on the mat. 
letting go of any and all intention. Let everything weigh heavy. No muscular holdings. Take any wiggles or scratches, full body stretches if needed. We'll draw one sole foot to the mat and then the other. Go ahead and hug those knees in. Wrap your arms around to give yourself a big old hug for a beautiful practice, for taking the time to take care of you. over to the right side. Take a big breath in through your nose. And a long, slow exhalation out your nose. And with eyes closed and attention remaining inward, make your way to a comfortable cross-leg seated position. Let's round forward into cat. Let's bring your right palm to your heart center, left on top of your right, really caressing your heart really feeling into you, feeling all that you are, appreciating all that you are. Notice your energy now compared to when we first stepped on the mat together. How did this practice treat you in body and mind and in spirit? Now with your palms to your heart center, take a moment to just truly say thank you to yourself. Now let's take a big beautiful breath and circling your fingertips up to the sky, gathering love and light. Palms kiss and bring all that love and light down to heart center. Bring your thumbs to your sternum to seal the love and light in and reach your sternum up towards your thumbs. Bow forward, sending love and light to you and all beings. Namaste. For my yogi friends who joined me for the 31 days of yin and yang, comment the hashtag yin yang yoga love in the comments of this video to celebrate completing the 31 days, supporting one another, and truly honoring that time you carved out for yourself each and every day dedicated to deepening your relationship with your body. We did it, my friend. Now, this is a free yoga training plan that you can get at any time. So if you're just now learning about it, no worries. Pop down to the description of this video for the links to learn more and sign up. If you enjoyed this practice, please throw the video a thumbs up. And thank you tremendously from the bottom of our hearts for all your love and support. If you have been enjoying our practices for a while, I'd love for you to take a moment to subscribe to our channel now. This will make sure that you get the latest yoga love practices released each week so you never miss a practice. Have a beautiful rest of your day and a peaceful night's sleep.